karibu sana katika my youtube channel na kwenye video hii nitaelekeza ni namna gani niliweza kuchukua niliweza ku trade entry ya niliweza kupata entry ya gold okay kitu cha kwanza kabisa unapoenda kwenye chat yoyote okay Nita, nitaenda moja kwa moja kwenye time frame ambayo niliingia okay So this is this is gold. Where did I sell? Did I sell these areas? This area to this point. Okay. Kitu cha kwanza kabisa. Before analysis, chart ilikuwa hivi. So nita shum kwamba this part was not there. Okay. This part was not there. Okay. Hii ili eneo rote halikuwepo. Okay. So chart ilikuwa hivi. So kitu cha kwanza kabisa unatakiwa kufahamu POIs au areas of interest. Kwa hiyo nilianza na kuchola this one. Kitu cha kwanza unatakiwa kufahamu unapokuwa unachola POI kuna vitu vya kuangalia. Kitu cha kwanza lazima ili POI iweze kuwa very strong lazima kuwe na inefficiency kuwe na high momentum lakini pia lazima itokee break of structure kwa hiyo this one was the first poi and then tulikuwa nayo nyingine hii hapa juu this one that's why this one was already mitigated okay unaweza kaona ilikuwa tayari mitigated maana yake haina umuhimu sana alafu we had another one tulikuwa nayo nyingine ambayo ni you can take it this one here this one minor one okay sawa so, So this was this were very very important points ambazo kwenye trading tulikuwa tuna tuna expect. So price ilitoka hapa with very very high momentum ikatengeneza FTR kendo ambayo pia ni POI yetu. Uh, then ilienda juu. So unaweza kuona uh, price baada ya kuwa imefika hapa juu iliweza kuonyesha some double top then ikaanza kutengeneza some shift of market structures coming downward, okay? Sasa ilivyofika this area ilivyofika this area kwenye eneo kama hili ndo niliona uh, nilianza kufanya analysis okay so how did i get this entry uh, in short ni kwamba kulikuwa na some strong demand ambazo zilikuwa zinatengenezwa while price ilikuwa inashuka chini okay sasa Ukiangalia vizuri unaweza kaona kwamba hii ya juu hii ilikuwa tayari mitigated sawa so, so sitaichola and then the second one the second one was here or this one okay wala ambao waliangalia analysis kwenye whatsapp waliona This one was the second one alafu so nitabadili rangi kwa sababu this is like a demand okay Tutaweka rangi maybe nyeusi Tutaweka nyeusi Okay And then another one nyingine ilikuwa hii hapa Sasa hapa kuna this one uh, nitaelezea hii so it is not only about the body wale ambao wanaongelea order broke supply and demand lakini this one was not the right one kwa sababu gani kwa sababu break of structure movement ambayo ilisababisha break of structure this break of structure this one here below so 
movement haikuanzia hapo ilianzia kwenye this something like a pin bar this one ya yeah, blue okay gold itakuwa kuchora this one okay now this is where i got that entry okay i got that entry na tp ilikuwa hapa chini that's why it is sell kwenye that point to this point to this this point hapa mwisho kabisa na stop loss yangu ilikuwa very ilikuwa tight sana. Niliweka tu hapa kwa sababu niliamini kwamba kama ingevunja this point tulikuwa tunaenda juu zaidi. Okay? Sasa tukienda kwenye higher time frame. Why why this one was very very important? Kwanza kabisa kulikuwa na shift of market structure hapa. Unaona this high the next high was raw so the, the, that is the meaning of shift of market structure lakini kitu kingine ni kwamba kama ungeenda kwenye time frame kubwa zaidi ungekuta order block ya hapa ni hivi that means it was already mitigated that is why this one was the very very essential very very essential uh, order block okay that's why it is sell to this level na as you can see ilitokea kama ambavyo ambavyo nilionyesha okay so he atp was hit this was how nilifanya analysis na nili take profit hapa um analysis ambayo naweza nikakuhakikishia it might happen ni hapa chini ni hapa chini ukiangalia vizuri tulikuwa na another very very important POI ambayo ilivunja this structure na kulikuwa na very high momentum this one this one haikuguswa okay uh, sasa kwa sababu haikuguswa hii tunaita liquidity injection tunaita liquidity injection so na expect baadaye price ikija itakuja kutouch na ku reverse so this was just inducement of liquidity next time it touch lazima itageuza lazima itageuza lazima itageuza okay kama ilivyofanya hii kitu okay see ilikuja like this afrika geuza so this was also inducement the rejection candle this one mm, this was this was inducement so even this one no, sorry so even this one here below ni inducement pia okay that is inducement for more training uh training na ambiaga always ni dola 100 okay always ni dola 100 sawa na make sure make sure unavokuna ingia this kind of entries this kind this entry nili miss na nili post pia this entry ni miss kwa sababu haikugusa hapa okay na that's why niliishia hapa tip yangu kwenye this level kwa sababu this 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 was just like taking some liquidity below this POI sawa so, ndo maana pia naita liquidity inducement okay so imechukua liquidity imeenda so kuna some liquidity here below uh, sell side liquidity au sell stop liquidity zipo hapa chini that's why lazima price ikija na amini hapa ita touch and then tuta buy okay market haitafungwa uh, leo usiku so on monday tutaangalia kitu kama hicho lakini kwa hapo juu uh, we cannot take cause uh, to siwezi nikajua direction moja kwa moja kwa sababu tayari imeshafika kwenye apex point unaweza kaona <coughs> still still hatujui either it break up au itarudi chini like irudi chini i believe kabisa lazima ije tap hapa alafu ita itaenda juu so this was gold na this was the simplest way ya kufanya analysis nitakuwekea link ya ku join telegram Telegram itakuwa na live streaming kupitia uh, Telegram app siku zijazo so make sure 
una join thanks for listening kwa wale ambao wanahitaji affidavit